Oh, hey, it's Grant here, and uh, I am back at Blair High School after three weeks at Fort Calhoun. Quincy broke the Pioneer streak and is this week's Athlete of the Week. Quincy Nichols had seven catches for 160 yards and three touchdowns against Skyler. It was his second straight game with three touchdown catches, and it just so happened to be the game where he caught his 100th career pass. Congrats, Quincy. Thank you. All right, so kind of just tell me about uh, your career as a wide receiver for the Blair Bears. Did you ever think that you would be the guy, the first guy, to hit 100 career catches? Um, I mean, as a sophomore year, I kind of started off, they, I mean, they kind of knew of me and nothing really too big, and then I started against Elkhorn South, and then I just started to play more and more, and then, of course, last year I played a lot, I started, and then this year I'm back again, and I just, I don't know, I just, I never really thought I'd hit 100, but. Okay. Uh, out of those hundred, how many do you think were with one hand? Oh gosh, probably three, four, <laughs> maybe. <laughs> what do your coaches say when you go up with one hand on some of those catches during practice? Uh, they just scream at me two hands most of the time. <laughs> yeah, all right, cool. And then uh, I wanted to talk about uh, your quarterbacks. Obviously, it was Ethan Cox and then Stewart Seamer this year, right? Yep. Uh, it was those just the two, right? Uh, yeah, just those two. Okay, so kind of just tell me about how well over the years they've been able to uh, get you the ball and. Obviously, you're not doing it all by yourself unless no. unless you tell me you are. No, I'm not. No. <laughs> okay. Um, sophomore year, I had Ethan, and he is he was really mobile and he could he could sling it. Um, he, I, I don't think I ever got a bad pass from him besides maybe one. That was a corner, but that's all I can think of. And Stewart, Stewart does a great job. He he finds me no matter what. We just we just have a connection. We've been playing together since we were in third grade, and it's just kind of always been our thing. So. Okay, excellent. And then my last question, obviously, it's a big game this week. It's homecoming week. Uh, so just kind of tell me how the team's feeling. Are they excited about this game more than others, or is it just good to be home after two weeks away? Um, I, I think we're really pumped up. You know, they got a good quarterback, and I think I think we're ready to, as Sabota would say, snot bubble him. But I think we're going we're gonna to try to shut him down, and I think we're gonna, our defense is going to perform well, and I think we can do whatever we want on offense. So. All right. And uh, point to where the stadium is so everybody who wants to go to the game can. Uh, yeah, the let's game. go right over Better, here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, this is our Athlete of the Week, Quincy Nichols, the only guy with 100 catches ever at Blair High School. This week's videographer is... Coach Flynn. 